George, George, George of the jungle, strong as he can be. Watch out for that tree! George, George, George of the jungle, lives a life that's free. Watch out for that tree! When he gets in a scrape, he makes his escape with the help of his friend. An ape named Ape, then away he'll schlep on his elephant Shep, Magnolia, and Ursula stay in step. I'll be the first scientist to study a hyena feeding in person. Wait, that's a science me talking. Oh my gosh, it's gonna eat me! Oh! Yeah, buddy. I don't care if he has nowhere else to live. It's disgusting. There's no time to explain, so watch this short movie instead. Still being eaten here. Ahem, the movie, please. Oh, sorry, was that my cue? <laughs> right. <clears throat> Many years ago, No-Go Valley was known as Go-Go Valley and was the vacation destination for the jungle masses. The resort was run by unicorns who used their magical powers of hospitality to bring five-star vacations to all. That is, until one simple snorkel blast changed everything. The unicorns flipped out, then kicked out. Uh, everyone, I mean. And Go-Go Valley became No-Go Valley, forbidden to all by jungle law. But what happened if someone crossed lines? Who cares? Help me! No one knows. But it's something terrible. And worse, it's against the rules. You cannot step across. Uh, Magnolia matter more. Stop! This is terrible! Why'd I even get out of bed this morning? Hey! Me save you from breaking rules now! Hey! George never step across, so he no break rules. barely crossed the line, and he only did so to save our resident genius scientist. <laughs> oh, me love your funny hats. <laughs> He's so tiny and cute. This isn't right. He barely broke the rules. <laughs> I will save it for the judge. Wow, George never been in jungle court before. So clean. Your Honor, while it is true George broke a rule, he only did so to save Magnolia. Surely you can't punish him for that. <laughs> ah, the prosecution didn't even bother to show up. That means not guilty by default. Your Honor, I'd like to... Ah! <laughs> prosecution say guilty! Guilty? Preposterous. <laughs> 500 moons in jungle jail? That's even worse. <laughs> I'm guilty too and must also go to jail? <gasps> so we win? I didn't do anything wrong. Neither of us did. <laughs> I did tell it to the judge. Look, it, new friend. <laughs> Oh, 
George, we have to get out of here. We don't belong with these low lives. George likes jail. Guards tell George when to eat and sleep. <laughs> George always forgets. But we're innocent. <laughs> that's what they all say, bro. And that's what you get for breaking the rules. I've never broken a single rule in my life. Uh, are you getting a tattoo? Lemurs say it make me look tough. Arr! Pirate tough. Ted, you know me. I'm not a scofflaw. A what? A felon. Huh? A culprit? You can make up all the words you want, but you're still in jail, bro. But you've broken rules far more than I have. Oh, yeah? Like when? <laughs> hey! No running in the pool, bro! <laughs> but you heard me! <laughs> I told you! But that isn't our house! Ah! We're doomed! Speak for yourself, bro! But... but you're breaking the laws of physics! I don't care, bro! This bird's gotta fly! Huh. Okay, well, I guess that's what you get for not breaking the rules! <laughs> you can't win, bro. Ape okay? I've wasted my life. George, following the rules isn't right. It's wrong. Huh? We're breaking the rules and breaking out of here. Huh? <laughs> Ape! Hurry up, George! But Ape always tells George to be good and follow rules, so George can't escape jail. What? Tonight, meatloaf night. Mmm. Oh, band aid. Then you're on your own, George. I'll come see you at visiting hours. I owe you one, Bernard. Thank goodness we grew up in the same neighborhood. That escape. It was so exhilarating. Who knew being bad could feel so good? I wonder. Cowabunga! <laughs> hey, free jail! Personal high five! <laughs> Excelsior! Seventeen, eighteen, twenty-two, fifty! Oh. Thanks for spot, Ricardo, Adam, Horatio. Ha! Thanks, Diapers. <laughs> it's better on me than in you. I'm not supposed to do this, but... Ah, it feels so good. I know you're not supposed to plug that up and see if it'll explode, but it sure sounds like fun. It's gone back. Someone must stop him! We're that lazy king of jungle! Oh, that me! If George break out, he break rules. But if he no break out, ape break rules! But maybe it okay to break rules to help? Okay! George be bad for a good reason! Bubbles, Tony Log Pants, Honey Badger, George need clever plan to escape. <laughs> And worthy of a king, if I do say so myself. <laughs> George, you broke out! Fantastic! Doesn't it feel great? No, it hurt. It go bad, so must go back to jail to become good again. <laughs> I'm afraid not, George. I finally realized what I missed all these years being a goody goody. Hey!
and breaking the rules is. <laughs> oh, but it's still wrong. I don't care. I'm never going to change. I'm a free ape now, and I do whatever I want. Like go into No-Go mm -hmm. Valley? Exactly! <laughs> This rule doesn't even matter. Oh my. Oh, 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 she stopped. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Whoa. Shouldn't you help Ape? No. Unicorns teach Ape lesson. Oh, 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 my sensitive bottom. But spanking go too far. Believe it or not, unicorns are horribly violent creatures. Who am I kidding? No one will believe me. George, thank you for helping me realize that rules are there for a reason. Like no-go valley rule. <sighs> Precisely. Oh, well. George do crime, he do time. You want French braid again? Okay, okay, no French braid. The heart of the jungle holds many dark secrets. Mysterious artifacts hidden from prying eyes. Hello! Can we pick up the pace already? I don't have all day! I was trying to set a mood here. Sheesh. Uh, are we there yet? Oh, we're here all right. You! Now carry me inside! Oh! Ow! Ow! <laughs> Uh, golly, uh, shouldn't we check for... Caspin, ah! stop being such a... <gasps> I knew it was real. I knew it! Hooray! Logs are real? You idiot! I don't care about the log. I care about this. The legendary load stick. It has more power than you can possibly oh. imagine. Oh. Nice work, George. Trick is waiting for a dramatic moment. That's mine. Get it back, Caspit. Ow! I got it, Doctor. I got stickhead hurt face for you. Oh, my. Uh, you got little... Stick in face there. Get your filthy head off my load stick! No! Magic stick not for bad people! <laughs> Hands off oh, that mystical oh, artifact! Oh, I smell bacon! Ow! 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 I feel funny! <gasps> oh my gosh! Did I do that? No my gosh, you didn't. That was the load stick. Whoever holds it, or has it stuck through their head, I guess, has ultimate control over all wood. Control that's supposed to be mine! So give it back already! This won't hurt, will it? <laughs> with you two yo-yos right now. Uh, I wish I had a yo-yo. Hey, quit showing off. George, use your teeth. George and Ape defeat you, evil person. <laughs> You'll never defeat me! Uh, George and Ape talking to him. Could you scoot a little to the left? Little more? Perfect! Surrender stick, Toothhead! Oh, oh! This is where I say something like, Never! And then laugh? <laughs> Doctor? 
I guess it's, I mean, it's not what I would have done. Oh, watch this! Ah! Wowee, that was fun, wasn't it, Doc? Doc? Oh. Gosh, that was a great battle. We really socked it to him. Whatever. Ooh, can we gloat now? I've never gloated before. How about evil one? Good none. <laughs> Up high. Aw, uh, you must be tired. Don't worry. We'll get to beat up George and Ape again soon. <laughs> Evil's the best. <laughs> Want to hear me do Mary Had a Little Lamb? No. Someone's a sulky pants. Bet I can cheer you up. and Cuspid win again! <laughs> that tooth! He's unstoppable! But, but I wanted to be unstoppable! Hang in there, guys! I'll help you stop this super powerful, incompetent, evil tooth villain! Careful! That's a Canadian maple! Okay, get it together, Stuart. Mad science always cheers me up. Nothing says happy like a laser drone. Fine! I'll just design... What is this happening? It's, it's like Cuspid's the villain and I'm the sidekick! <laughs> Guess who's the brand new evil emperor of all animals? It's me. Cool, huh? Oh, don't worry. You can be Emperor Junior. <laughs> Doc, what you doing? Coming out anytime soon? Can I help? <laughs> Not first time George wished he was Beaver. Ow! Hello, chums. Ah! It's back! Uh, can I ask you for advice? Huh, I suppose. It's not like we're doing anything else this episode. No kidding. This is clearly a Chicago cuspid story. I don't even know why I got out of my tent. Sheesh. <laughs> no listen to her. <laughs> What's wrong, Big Tooth? Beside ultimate jungle power stick stuck in brain. I think the doctor's mad at me, but I beat you guys up and won and everything. It's not as simple as that, Cuspid. The doctor's a proud man. Cuspid! <laughs> and more than a little unstable. Give me that stick now! Hi, Doc! <laughs> Tree face! My new battle bot doesn't contain one sliver of wood! But Doc! I don't want to fight you! I should be the one with the ultimate power! Shh! It's okay. I hate you! I hate you! Oh, George sure he not mean it. I was only doing it for you. Yes! It's mine! All mine! Yay! You're a super villain now! That makes me your sidekick again! <laughs> Don't make me laugh! This magic stick is my sidekick now! Now get lost! I never want to see you again! That's the saddest sound I've ever heard. How... how do I turn this on? Is there a switch or a, a leaf I have to squeeze? Ah, never mind! Now we finally get on! 
on with this. <laughs> the jungle is mine! George is at my mercy! This is everything I've always wanted! Isn't it? Boys say ha ha, but leaky eyes say boo hoo. That's ridiculous! I'm overjoyed! See? <laughs> I'm not crying! I'm not! This is sweat! George thinks Chicago missed Cuspid. He betrayed me! Only true friend lose fight on purpose. But... Bah! I still don't need that little abomination. Dad? Am I... an abomination? Yes, Cuspid! My abomination! <laughs> Yay! Toast! I already miss his inane laugh, his funky smell, his lazy eye. Aw, that nice. But why doctor saying it to George? Someone else need to hear it more. I'm sorry, Cuspid! Yay! I can be your sidekick again? No, Cuspid. I'll be your sidekick. Gosh, but... No. You're the real supervillain in our family. But I want you to have it. Thanks, but I want you to have it more. Take no it. way. Yes, you way. want it. It's a gift. I'm gifting. <laughs> Oops. George's turn. <laughs> um, how it work? Oops. George meant to make heart around them. Just remember, Cuspin, this is all your fault. It always is. It always is.